and then we will go to aromatic amines. Remember, as I told you before, whenever we discuss this uh, basicity of the aliphatic amines, we are discussing it in the aqueous phase. It will be different in the vapor phase. It will be different from the vapor phase. Okay. So, if you want to get the structure, you will get an idea. Ammonia, you have like this. It has got a lone pair and you have one hydrogen substituted with R and you have another hydrogen also substituted with R and you have R, the last hydrogen also substituted with R. So from this you can you can infer that the lone pair on nitrogen when this an amine becomes more basic when it can readily donate a lone pair, then we call that as a more basic. There is one inductive effect operating on this. Here you see there are two inductive effect operating on this. Here you see three inductive effect operating on this. Now you have, we can say 0 degree, 1 degree, 2 degree, 3 degree. If in the null compound, in the compound, the nitrogen electron rich arc. Which one do you think will be more rich in electrons? Tertiary will be more rich in electrons. Okay. So, it's obvious. Therefore, only something which is rich can donate better. Therefore, order of basicity of the tertiary, secondary, primary and zero degree. Decreasing order of basicity. Decreasing order of basicity. Based on, based on, and this is due to the plus a effect, plus a effect of the alkyl groups. This is how you will have the uh, basic character of the amines based on this aliphatic amines. Now, when compared to ammonia. So, what you can infer from this, in the inference on IAS, whenever you get a question on predicting the basicity of the given set of amines, and the, in, the, in the points, okay, so, this point, and then this point. Two points you have. So, this is the Ammonia, ammonia is less basic. Ammonia is less basic than aliphatic amines. In the relationship, so that when we predict a set of compounds, in the two of the Because carboxylic acid lump, benzoic acid would compare derivatives of benzoic acid every year than Radana Malam Pato, ortho, meta, para, ortho effect. Meta para and para and marilla number patho. So the first basic assumption or understanding is ammonia is less basic than aliphatic amines. Idu one of the board la concept question ke paanga. And uh, ammonia is less basic than aliphatic amines. Give reason. Ammonia is less basic than aliphatic amines. Give reason. And a reason it is due to the plus a effect of the alkyl groups which increases the electron density on the nitrogen therefore aliphatic amines can more readily donate a lone pair of electrons thereby acting as a good Lewis base okay so that is one first inference that you can arrive at the uh, we can see that uh, uh, okay example so methylamine, ethylamine, trimethylamine, ammonia and the madri number So example one and methylamine methylamine or methylamine ammonia 
डाइमिथाइल अमीन डाइमिथाइल अमीन एंड ट्राइमिथाइल अमीन अरेंज इन इंक्रीजिंग बेसिक कैरेक्टर arrange an increasing basic nature okay so ammonia is the uh, least one so ammonia will be the first least one followed by ketoro okay so idu predict panniko idella vande the basic 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 basicity of the aliphatic amines la vand there are three effects that operate on this we will be seeing that ipo nama paathirukkaru ore ore effect mattum da adhavadhu inductive effect plus i effect mattum da nam ipo paathirukkom there are three effects which operates on the uh, basic nature of the aliphatic amines okay so nama kadasiya nama after studying the three effects then only you will be able to predict the first one the plus i effect rendavadhu vandu hydrogen bonding moonavadhu vandu steric factors moonavadhu vandu steric factors of the alkyl groups steric factors of r in the moonu thi poruthu da aliphatic amines nodiya basic nature irukku ஓகே ஸோ இப்போ இந்த கொஸ்டின் இப்போ நீ ஆன்சர் பண்ண வேண்டாம் இப்போ வெறும் இன்டக்டிவ் எஃபெக்டை மட்டும் வச்சு ஆப்ரேட் பண்ணுறதா இருந்தால் என்ன வரும் அரேஞ்ச் த ஃபாலோயிங் இன் இன்க்ரீசிங் பேசிக் நேச்சர் வித் ரெஸ்பெக்ட் டு ப்ளஸ் ஐ எஃபெக்ட் அப்படி நான் ஒன்று கொஸ்டின் ஸ்பெசிஃபிக்காக கொடுத்தா நீ எப்படி ஆன்சர் பண்ணணும் அமோனியா வில் பி த லீஸ்ட் ஃபாலோடு பை ப்ரைமரி ஃபாலோடு பை செகண்டரி ஃபாலோடு பை டர்ஷரி ஓகே ஸோ அந்த ஆர்டரில் உனக்கு வரும் So, either we have to do ammonia will be the least followed by primary, followed by secondary, followed by tertiary. This will be the answer. Okay, with respect to inductive effect. Now we have to consider the. Uh, எக்ஸ்டென்ட் ஆஃப் ரெண்டாவது ஹைட்ரஜன் பாண்டிங் எப்படி வருது அது நம்ம ஏற்கனவே நம்ம பார்த்தோம் சாலிபிலிட்டிலையும் இதுலேயும் நம்ம பார்த்தோம் ஃபார் எக்ஸாம்பிள் இஃப் யூ ஹேவ் திஸ் ஆர் என்ஹெச் டூ இந்த ஹைட்ரஜன் பாண்டிங் மட்டும் நான் சொல்லிடுறேன் பிகாஸ் செரிக் எஃபெக்ட் வில் சி லேட்டர் ஆர் என்ஹெச் டூ ப்ளஸ் ஹெச் ப்ளஸ் கொடுத்தா உனக்கு என்ன ஆகும் திஸ் வில் ட்ரை டு வாட்டரில் வந்து வாட்டரில் ஹெச் ப்ளஸ் இருக்கு இல்லையா ஸோ யூ ஹேவ் ஆர் என் H or NH, moon hydrogen on a curve. You have three hydrogen like this. So each hydrogen form can form a hydrogen bonding with water like this. Can form a water. So primary amine can form three hydrogen bonds. So obviously secondary amine you have to form one now. So it can form four hydrogen bond to form bundle, and uh, if you, I just told you, coordinate bond to put it in which co. If you take one more plus earth gray, abdi na, in more hydrogen go to the lower day abdi na, then it can form two like this secondary. So it will form two hydrogen bonds. it will form two hydrogen bonds that is secondary amine idu vandu primary amine so tertiary amine la paathena tertiary amine la r3n lone pair irukku appadina and lone pair la ni h plus potana one one da unak varu you will have only one uh, r3n plus h 
can form only so tertiary can form only one hydrogen bond so this is what you have to remember in the case of boiling point with respect to hydrogen bonding now hydrogen bonding or the boiling point enna agum appadina the more it, it the hydrogen bonding provides stability more hydrogen bonding better stability so better stability varadnal enna aidum primary amine will be more stable anything which is more stable can donate a better can act as a better base ipo idhula paathena rendu hydrogen bonding form panna kuda idhula indha or lone pair poiduthu inga inde idhula ivuluk lone pair poiduthu so appo enna avo naturally the strength of hydrogen bonding will decrease so based on the hydrogen bonding nu paathen sonna na edhu ivuluk strong a irukum primary amine will be forming moon hydrogen bonding irukku followed by secondary followed by tertiary based on hydrogen bonding based on hydrogen bonding so compound stable a irundha dhaan adu bond form panna mudiyum electron donate panna mudiyum compound stable a illana adu panna mudiyadhu so and the aspect la paakumbodhu primary amine is more stable than the secondary and tertiary amine therefore it can more stably donate a lone pair of electron when compared to secondary and tertiary so based on hydrogen bonding it will be like this okay so i will stop here in the next class we will see the other steric effect and then we will discuss the various types of amines and their basicity namba carboxylic acid ku paatha maadhiri nariya derivatives of amines pappu idhu or important ana topic board la vandu kandippa unakku or question varum idhil irundhu that is predicting the trend onnu acidic acidic trend kekkaanga illa basic trend kekkaanga indha rendu la kandippa edavadhu onnu உனக்கு கேட்கும் ஓகே ஸோ 